there's just a feeling of wanting to connect through a question, but I don't have a question yet. I have no idea what I'm doing. Yes, there is never any idea when conditioning is not playing. The only time there is an idea is when one is living out of the conditioned box. Having no idea stops feeling odd and begins to be recognized as real life. Having an idea at that point is recognized to be dead. Death playing as life. The thing about having no idea is in the beginning, the mind is still busy. There is still some sense of responsibility, still some feeling like maybe I'm on shaky ground here. Maybe I'm making a mistake. <laughs> maybe someone will see something. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> but it's too late. <laughs> you raised your hand. <laughs> You know, the beauty of it is nothing matters. <laughs> nothing matters. What difference does anything make? It doesn't. No, it doesn't. I guess it's, there's a sense of unease that comes up about having no clue what I'm doing. I think that's Yes, it, it is the case in the beginning. You know, when you have no idea what's coming, but you have a sense of something good, that's called excitement. When you don't know what's coming, and you have a sense of something bad, that's called fear. When you have no sense, no thought, and you are present, these are the richest, most beautiful moments of the life. So what is going on is there is a sense of being on unsure footing because there is a subliminal message that there is someone who is in no man's land, but all of that is knowing. All of that is a story that is trying to sabotage, to keep the experience of the cardboard box alive by saying that if you are not knowing, you are out on a limb and it's dangerous, but it's all just a story. When you are walking out in the fields on the land that you live, the draw is because you are not busy knowing, maybe sometimes, but that's when you're miserable. The draw is that you're not in knowing. In the beginning, the mind throws up a smoke screen. So what? Maybe there are some sensations of discomfort. It's just the smoke. It is just the feeble attempt to keep you in prison.
you know, there is something very beautiful in there. There is something very beautiful in every player. So there is a courage to take a risk. It's a kind of strength. What, are you going to say more? No. <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> I was, but n not anymore. <laughs> you know, the reason why it's funny is because it's all... But you said in the beginning to me several times when you were talking with me and there was hope that it wouldn't still be the beginning. There was hope that it wouldn't be the beginning? Yeah. It's not. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it is the farthest thing. <laughs> The Before beginning. the beginning. Got it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Before the beginning. Okay. Yeah. It's all a joke. All of it. Every belief. Hoping that it's that you're not in the beginning. I mean, what does that mean? Honestly, it's, I'm just being honest. Yeah? It's wanting the suffering to end soon. It's wanting what? The suffering to end faster. Let the suffering end right now. Soon is a delay. Let the suffering end right now. You know when the suffering ends? When I stop resisting. The suffering ends when you stop trying to get from where you are to your mind's idea of where you should be. Seeking is suffering. It's procrastination. It's an assumption that something is wrong when everything is right. For two minutes, let go of the past. For two minutes, let go of the past. You can do that. I cannot do that for you, but you can do that to simply let go of the story of the past for two minutes. There is no such thing as the past. It's an illusion. It's already recognized that there is no such thing as the past. When you let go of the story of something that you have no relationship with at all, except in a story, if you let go of that story, there is no Daniel. Daniel comes out of the story. There is no identity. The identity comes out of the story. There is nothing prior. It all comes out of the story. You have no idea who the hell I am. That all comes out of the story. You don't know who anyone is. You don't know what a room is, what a fan is. You don't know anything. Now you tell me if you're suffering. No. There is a very deeply ingrained story that you're screwing up. 
it's all a bunch of crap. There is not a shred of truth to it. But the thing about it is that arrogance wants to hold on to it for all it's worth. And then there are these emotions that are so overwhelming, that are so deeply stuck to it. It is all an indulgence. There is a story, I cannot help it. It's just another story. All of this can be taken as further fuel for I am failing, but there's no one there. Granted, there are times in the journey when the fire is hot. You are going through a time when the fire is hot. When the fire is hot is the richest of times and the most challenging of times. Because when the fire is hot, every single time there is identification, it stings. There is nothing that deconditions the habit, like every single time there is identification when it stings. It is the grace of suffering. It is God's grace. It is a gift that is being bestowed unto you. You can receive this. When there is a getting out of the wave, the deeper the forgetting, the harder it seems to get out of the way. But it is only an instant. When the forgetting returns, it's allowing the holy bonfire to burn. It is all God's will. It is all in your highest good, no matter what you think. There is nothing missing there, no matter what the belief. There is nothing wrong. There is nothing out of place. All of these latent habits are really firing. Let it come. There's nothing you can do about it anyway. This is all coming up to prove to you that you are not a victim. If you get seduced into the belief you are a victim, then it is not serving its role. There is no one sitting in this room that has not gone through a time like this. As far as being at the beginning, everyone is always at the beginning, including myself. Did you get your money's worth? <laughs> 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 Thank you. I love you. <laughs>